Guys, Shredder here. We are going to have a crack at the Fairway Rough Royale today. So this one is pretty much, um, it's all hive in the first round and all hive in the last round. And then it's whichever choice of club you want to use in the um, second round, which is the rough shots. Now, I obviously still stick with my yellow jacket here purely for speed. I've actually tried using Voodoo on this, and it's just outside no adjust with backspin. Um, but if it's with topspin, it's going to be a little more dicking around, and it's actually not easy to, to get them in the hole. So uh, you are better off using yellow jacket for the second round. <clears throat> Excuse me. As you can see here, I'm almost always no spin or full back spin. Um, there's none here where I use top spin at all. Not, none in the first or third round. But I do back the backspin off in a crosswind. So I might use three, three or four bars or something like that. Now with these ones, even though I'm curling to the left, I'm also actually releasing slightly early um, so that I'm not too far over to the right. <clears throat> and I'm not pulling these down past the normal release point because we don't need any extra in a tailwind. One of these days, one of these ones is going to drop. Goodness me. So that one was only two or three bars of backspin, which is pretty reasonable. Late release to the right to counter that wind. So there were at least two players in there that dropped one of those holes. And as you can see the, the point difference there with getting each shot off on the first swing. And keeping it relatively simple. No real need to aim these ones. They're not too far out of no adjust. Now this one... Um, countering the wind is minimal because you're only just outside, no adjust. So I'll show you what I do. So for this one, I pull down just a little bit to the left and try and release ultimate. Boy, uh, get in there. This one I don't pull down to the right at all. I only pull that straight down, but I didn't pull it far enough. Goodness me. Down to the left a little bit. Didn't pull down far enough. But yeah, you can see this is all just practice. Full overpower for that one. There we go. The perfect amount of pull and, and curl. Can we do it two in a row? No, we cannot.
Oh, that one let go a bit late, a bit slow on the pull down. And we'll squeeze another one off here. Ah, right in the hole, just not good enough. Goodness me. So yeah, with some of that quick shotting there, I have um, had three hole outs. But somebody's had five hole outs in that. <clears throat> and that just proves the point that you don't need to you don't need to aim this. You're better off doing it with speed. You might get a couple to drop. And as I said, I've had three drop before, so it's entirely possible. Ten thousand is achievable in that round, but that round's not gonna win it for you. This is the harder round. The uh, you're only just outside no adjust here. So even pulling down to your normal shooting position is still going to get you um, to go over. Well, that's pretty good. I'm happy with that. And you, if you use full backspin on these shorter ones... <clears throat> um, you will end up backspinning off the green and onto the fairway. So you've really got to be careful with that. So it didn't go full backspin. Five or six bars pulls up nicely. Full backspin for the um, tailwinds. Hey, look at that. Hey, get in the hole. And that's how I do the Fairway Rough Royale. Hopefully some of that works for you. And you can see the advantages of quick shots versus um, aiming the shots. Nobody was really close to me in any of the rounds, despite the fact somebody holed out five times in round two. So, yeah. Quick shot is the king. And the king of the quick shot is Webbo. And Webbo is the one that taught me how to do this kind of stuff. He does have a channel on YouTube, you know. It's just that he hasn't got time to put stuff up anymore, you know. Real life takes precedence over gaming. And I don't really have a life, so... <clears throat> That's why I'm here. But I will have a life soon, so I may not be able to put up this content as frequently as I am. But nevertheless, while I am here and able to do so... That's what I'm going to do. And the more royales and things that I can put up, the more idea you're going to have to play all of these royales. And there's tips and tricks for every single royale. Every single one. But mostly, you can play it with a base knowledge. And hopefully I'm helping provide you, you guys with that. So all in all, I hope you guys are, are looking after yourselves and staying well. I'm Shredder, and I will catch you next time round. Cheers.